Smile and learn. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to tell you how to calculate the length of the circumference. You're asking yourselves, what is it, and what's it for? The circumference is a curved, closed, flat line whose points are the same distance from the center. Owing to the fact that it's a line, its length is measured in feet, inches, or miles. The concept length of a circumference can also be referred to as the perimeter of a circle or the perimeter of the circumference. To start with, let's recap some elements of the circumference, like the center, the radius, or the diameter. Remember that the diameter is twice the radius, or in other words, the radius is half the diameter. The length of the circumference equals twice the radius by pi. Or in other words, the diameter of the circumference by pi. Remember that pi is 3.14. We are always going to use this number. Let's look at some examples. This circumference has a radius of 2.36 inches. To calculate its length, we should multiply the radius by 2 and multiply by pi. Great! The length of this circumference equals 14.82 inches. Let's look at some real-life situations. Mark wants to decorate this box of chocolates using some wrapping string. The radius of the circumference of the box measures 4 inches. How many inches of wrapping string does he need to buy? To figure it out, we need to calculate the length of this circumference. We multiply the radius by 2 and by pi. Excellent! Mark needs to buy 25.12 inches of wrapping string to decorate the box of chocolates. Let's look at another example. The mayor wants to put a fence around the fountain of the village. The fountain has a circular shape, and its diameter is 29.5 feet. How many feet of fencing material does he need to buy? To figure it out, we need to calculate the length of this circumference. We multiply the diameter by pi. The mayor needs to buy 92.71 feet of fencing material to surround the fountain. For every circumference in the world, pi is always the same number. That is to say, it equals 3.14. If you want to learn more about it, watch our video about the number pi. As you have seen, knowing how to calculate the length of a circumference is very important in construction, mechanics, or engineering. How would you like to try with another example? Did you like the video? We have so many more! Subscribe by clicking on the seal. Ah, and if you want to keep watching more videos, click on the boxes.